So recently my computer broke down and I got frustrated. But after some patience I repaired it. And then I had to reinstall all the application that I used to had. Wow. Well I use Filmora a lot and this funny thing happened. After reinstalling Filmora back into my PC, when I tried to log in with my account, it showed me that I am successfully logged in but my account subscription is free. Which basically means that if I export videos now then I will have that watermark. What? What the f Well, after getting frustrated as I've already purchased Filmora before and I can't use it now. I decided to write this angry email to Team Filmora. Well, after writing a whole two page email, where 90% time I was ranting and 10% time I was just asking for help, I decided not to send the email. Instead, like a civilized person, I decided to do the most civilized thing. I googled the solution, and voila, I found nothing. Well, after countless failure and no answer, I admitted my defeat and decided to mail Team Filmora. And I got this solution. And it was so easy that I just couldn't be able to believe what my eyes saw in that email. So, enough of this time waste and chitter chatter, and let's get into the main part. Hey there, everyone, I'm Imash Shumara, and you're watching Technomania. <laughs> Plunge on that crimson button and hit that ding dong to never miss amazing videos from us. So if you are also an unlucky person like me whose computer just broke down or you had to reinstall Filmora in your PC only to find out that your license is not working anymore, then here is the solution for you. Open your web browser, go to thewondersphere.com, here log in with the ID and password through which you bought the Filmora. Now go to this plans and products section. Here, click on this manage device and remove this particular ID. Well, technically the thing is that, when you install Filmora on your PC and log in with your account, then Filmora automatically generates a unique ID for your PC and register it with that. Well, let's say that somehow you need to reinstall the Filmora, then this ID will no longer be of use. So just simply remove this ID and head back over to your Filmora and then re-log in with your ID. But wait, if you're already logged in and it is showing a free account, then log out first from your Filmora and then remove the ID from the managed device. Then log in again in the Filmora. I know it's complicated, but that is the only way. Now Filmora again generate a new ID and then you can able to use your Filmora again without the watermark. I hope you find this solution helpful. Do like this video, subscribe to my channel and share this video. I'll see you in the next one. Till the next time, see you later.